Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. I think the circus, the shit show, becomes more and more embarrassing for the Ukrainian nation. Their president, Zelensky, who is Jewish, nothing wrong with that, is attending right now the Arab League summit in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. So, a Jewish president of Ukraine, Ukrainian, he's Ukrainian, participates in the Arab League summit in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. He is transported by France. So, France facilitates this. And then from Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, the president of Ukraine, who just participated in the Arab League summit, can make shit up, gonna fly to Japan to attend the G7 summit of the biggest economies in the world, except, uh, you know, uh, <clears throat> others that uh, were not supposed to be over there, you know what I mean? So, G7 meeting, the democratic econom um, economic powers of this planet, plus Zelensky from Ukraine. So, the Arabs are receiving a Ukrainian. G7 are receiving Ukraine over there. Tomorrow, we're going to have, I don't know, uh, basketball players attending, I don't know, playing in the football league or something like that. Nothing wrong with that. But don't you see a little bit of a circus here? There's no, no connection. You don't qualify for either. You don't qualify to participate in the summit. You don't qualify to participate in the G7. Well, I gotta just say, these guys invite whomever they want. If they want to invite a clown, they can invite a clown. It's up to them. I'm just pointing out that friends facilitates these clowns participation in these two uh, summits. And I don't think uh, the Arab League was, uh, you know, uh, anything was imposed on them or, again, they're going to let him talk and so on, which is fine. The thing is here, did you notice that after Ukraine attacked Moscow with uh, those two drones, well, I should leave uh, this like this, allegedly attacked Moscow with two drones. Zelensky is not really uh, staying at home. He immediately after the drones attacked Moscow fled. It was an unannounced surprise Finland uh, meet over there with the Nordic countries. But somehow uh, Ukraine participates uh, as part of the Nordic countries as Ukraine is part of the G7 and the Arab League. So he participated in the Nordic summit the night that the, Moscow was attacked. And then from then he participated and he went to France and then he went to Germany and he went to Europe and then he showed up, I think, for two days or a day and a half, supposedly, and had a little staff meeting somewhere in the bunker 50 uh, uh, meters below uh, ground level. And after that, he's just flying in Saudi Arabia. And then it's going to fly to Japan and then where? I mean, as many places he can fly, Tahiti and others, you know, Ibiza and so on. So I'm suspecting, and I said this before, that Zelensky is not going to spend a lot of time in Ukraine, especially outside in the sun anymore, for obvious reasons. Uh, obviously, the Patriot systems will take care of uh, any incoming Russian missile. But let me show you the articles here that I have. And interestingly enough, friends facilitates this weasel's travels. Well, let's see. I'm going to start with this little article, which is from Reuters initially. And uh, it is provided by SABC News. France taking Ukraine's Zelensky to Arab League G7 meeting. Source. So these are, you already have Zmihal here, the Prime Minister of Ukraine right here. Another Ukrainian, and you have the friends, you know, Macron, you have Schultz, you have Meloni alone here with her melons. You have the, I don't know if this is uh, the Japanese prime minister or not. Um, and then you, I think he is. And then you got this, where am I? 
and this guy, hey, I'm important, let me show you some dances here. This unelected woman and you have this weasel right here. Anyway, so these are, these, are, these are the guys, these are the leaders of G7, these are the most important people, all right? Then we have this article from us, Agency, uh, Agency France Press, the Associated Press. Zelensky to attend G7 summit Sunday as world leaders tighten san sanctions against Russia over Ukraine. So again, uh, this is what's his name, uh, I can't remember, he's um, the Prime Minister of uh, Japan. Mm, maybe I see it right here, Fumio. Prime Minister Fumio. Can't remember. Anyway, so this is the club right here. The, the club that we are allowed to see. Now, what's funny, not, uh, this is uh, right in Hiroshima, I think it is. This is uh, where that uh, atomic bomb was drop, dropped. <laughs> That's in Hiroshima. Where the atomic bomb was dropped by these guys right here, right? Over the civilian city. <laughs> it's, it's such an... Japan is molested, sexually molested again and again. So let's go to the next one. Zelensky right here, this is important. You see Zelensky? He's always now featured like this, like this guy, always looking like, you know, brought, brought you down or something. He's always like this. Zelensky arrives at Arab State Summit. I took this for the picture uh, right here. I watch this guy all the time. His face is always like this. They try, they try to resemble this guy in his determination to fight the Nazis in Russia. This is what they try to, to, to actually, you know, uh, impersonate this, the, the PR. He's not like this, he's a clown. Let's start with that one. But he's an actor, he has to play this, you know, tough guy, he's not smiling anymore. He's so concerned with the Ukrainian people that he has to save the world and he's right here, he's not going to bow down. Yeah, right here, baby doll. Boom, this is the guy. But for me, this is the guy, actually. This the guy, this the guy. This the guy, this the guy. This is Zoolander. Uh, it was a comedy a long time ago and uh, very funny this was a, a brainless model male model and he this was his uh, you know like uh, the most how should, imp imp impressive facial expression as you know like yeah that's me man i'm cool this is this is the funny face of this brainless male model I see the same thing here, but it's me. But they tr they aim for this. <laughs> so they aim for this guy, but they get this guy instead because we have this guy. Anyway, my friends, you tell me how in the hell Zelensky participates in all these meetings. I think they just put him around other people so that he can't be... Uh, you know what I mean. I think the, the Russians uh, are aiming right now to just harm this guy. Uh, up, up till now, they said no, no, no. But I think after the attack on the Kremlin, they will uh, probably take care of these guys and that's it. But if they take care of this guy, then really, really the mass media and the Americans and all that will say, see, see who the terrorist is, see who the sponsor of these assassinations uh, are when actually is the other ones assassinating people in Russia, like uh, Dugina and Turkiev, Tarkiev, whatever his name is, the blogger blown up with those things. I'm guaranteeing that it was not blown up by Romanians or by French people, right? So, um, but anyway, the terrorists are the Russians, but the other ones have nothing to do with that. That's why, you know, it's, it's very hard to swallow this uh, BS these guys are selling. When they tell me these are clean and these are dirty, all dirty, all clean. No, there's no such a thing in this kind of uh, situations. But anyway, he travels on, I don't know whose money, doesn't matter. And at this point, France takes him, go, goes around the world with him. So he, the plane cannot be shut down, if you know what I mean. Uh, it's a protection thing. And I, as I said, I foresee that Zelensky is not going to show up for a while in, uh, to see the sun and the blue skies of Hawaii. Surprise, surprise, he goes to uh, see the Arabs. 
Well, it's okay. I mean, maybe while he's at it, a Jewish guy participating in an Arab league, maybe he's going to, uh, I hope, uh, better the relations between Israel and uh, the Arabs. After all, everything for peace and love. Uh, but justice first. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.